welcome back to the channel everyone for this video we got the ascendant challenge for week nine into forsaken now this is the third ascendant challenge in a six week cycle and the portal can be found way out past the oracle now if you already know where the ascendant challenge is and you already know how to get there i'll have timestamps in the description below so you can skip forward if you're just looking for the eggs or just looking for the portal location that'll be there for you now to start this off, you just want to spawn in on the Dreaming City, make sure you pick up your Ascended Challenge Bounty, and then you just want to head towards the Oracle. Now this Ascended Challenge is pretty easy. There's a jumping puzzle to get up to a mini boss, and once up to the mini boss, you just get to take him out, the chest will spawn. Now if you have a Stunlock Super, that works pretty good, or Tractor Cannon, and the Aquilos will work pretty good. Now there's multiple ways to take them out. Now on my Hunter, I just used the Pool Dancer Super and stun locked him and he's pretty easy to take out. Now once you get to the Oracle, you can pop your Tincture of Queen's Foil here and as soon as you leave the Oracle Room, on the right side there will be a set of steps that can form and it get there a little bit quicker. And as always guys, there are two corrupted eggs in this ascendant challenge and if you are going for them you will need the wish ender bow in order to take them out now these two corrupted eggs are probably the easier ones to find and they're really not that hard to get to all right now once you get through the oracle and you get the whole way down the bridges you're going to keep going as far as you can go and then there's going to be a couple rocks that you can see you can jump to on the second set of rocks, you'll be able to jump out in the middle of nowhere and get into the portal. Now once you're in the portal, there are multiple ways to get up top. You just gotta avoid the blights from blowing you up or shooting you off the rocks. And of course there are some snipers out there trying to hit you. Pretty easy to take out. But you can follow the way I take. This is the fastest way I found. But it is not the only way. Like I said, there are multiple ways to get to the top. Now there is Tolan. If you go the way I go, you can sit here and talk to Tolan. Or you can just keep going like I did. And Tolan still will activate as long as you go by him. Down. And once you get up to the top guys, there's a little floating platform in the middle, that's where the boss will spawn in, and as I said before, I just used my pool dancer super, and you can stun lock him, and he dies relatively easy. Once it's done, you can pop your chest and get the rewards. And as I said before guys, these two corrupted eggs are relatively easy to find. Now the first one, where the chest spawned in, if you look above the portal, way up top, you'll find your first corrupted egg. And then for the second crop today, guys, if you want to go back down to the way you came up, you want to jump down on this statue here, 
And if you look off to the right and sit behind a pillar, that's what we'll find. The second and last corrupted egg in this ascendant challenge. As always guys, I hope this video helped you out. If it did, go ahead and give it a like. Feel free to share it to your friends so they can get this Senate challenge done and find those eggs. And newcomers to stream, go ahead and subscribe if you want to see some more D2 content like this.